All right, here's a question from Michael San Pietro, and um, he wants to know about "Sick as a Dog" and uh, um, uh, how we recorded the guitar and the bass part for it. Well, uh, I had written the song on guitar mostly, and uh, didn't hadn't really come up with a bass part that was especially unique besides simply reinforcing the chords on the guitar. So, um, when we were at the studio, uh, we worked it up when we were, while we were in the studio recording the uh, basics for uh, the Rocks album. And um, I started to show um, Brad and Joe the guitar parts. And they said, well, why don't you just play the guitar on this song? And um, um, Joe said, I'll play bass. And uh, so I said, okay, that's fine. You know, uh, and that way I played the guitar parts. You know, Brad and I worked out the guitar parts the way um, I had written them. And, you know, I knew that Joe would come up with a good solid bass line for it. But there was one um, little problem, and that was that Joe had to play a lead guitar break over the end of the song, where it kind of trails off into the end. So Stephen volunteered to play bass during that end part of the song, which we call the tag. And um, so when we were cutting the track, uh, we were in the studio all playing together, uh, jamming away. Uh, then there, there uh, comes a part in the song where everything gets quiet and empties out. And that was a perfect chance for Joe to quietly put down the bass, go into the control room where he had his guitar all set up, and for Stephen to come out of the control room and pick up the bass and continue on uh, when the whole band gets brought back in. And uh, it was really funny. It actually worked. <laughs>